Hi friends, this is your Yoga Nandam, Biology Lecture from Medal Academy YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to discuss one of the biology full test paper with detailed solutions. The number of obligate categories that are always used in a taxonomic hierarchy is Taxonomic hierarchy is the system of arrangement of taxonomic categories in descending order. It was introduced by Linnaeus in 1751 who initially proposed five categories such as class, order, genus, species and variety. However, variety was obtained and four new categories were introduced. Thus, the seven obligate categories in the descending order are kingdom, phylum or division, class, order, family, genus and species. So, the answer is option A. There are seven categories question number three from the following which is not a characteristic future of vector pbr 322 pbr 322 was the first artificial cloning vector constructed by bolivar and rotrikus in 1977 in pbr 322 p refers to plasmid BR refers to Bolivar and Rotrikus, the scientists that constructed this plasmid. 322 refers to the number given to distinguish this plasmid from other plasmids developed in some same laboratory. Plasmid PBR322 contains two resistant genes, namely ampicillin resistance, that is AMPR, and tetracycline resistance, that is TETR. These resistant genes are used as selectable markers. So the answer for this question is option C. Not a characteristic future of vector PBR322. Question number 4. This is chikungunya is transmitted by. This is chikungunya is transmitted by Aedes mosquito. The chikungunya virus causes chicken gunia fever joint pains and fever are its symptoms so the answer for this question is option b it is mosquitoes question number five the sickle cell anemia is sickle cell anemia is an autosome linked recessive trait that is transmitted from parents to offspring when both the parents are carrier for a gene Homozygous offspring show the diseased phenotype. Heterozygous individuals are unaffected of the disease but are carriers. Sickle cell anemia is caused by a change in single base pair of DNA. That means substitution of valine by glutamic acid in B globin chain of hemoglobin. So the answer is option C. An autosomal recessive inheritance. Question number 6. The regulatory proteins are the axillary proteins that interact with RNA polymerase and affect its role in transcription. Which of the following statements is true about regulatory proteins? The obron is a cistron with gene regulation activity basically absorbed in the prokaryotes. The Obron model of prokaryotic gene regulation was proposed by Jacob and Monard. Oprons are group of genes coding for related proteins and are arranged in units. It is the part of DNA which act as a single regulated unit having one or more structural gene such as operator, promoter and regulator gene. So the answer for this question is option D. They can act both as activators and as uh, repressors. So that statement is uh, true about regulatory proteins. Question number 8. Scientist credited for showing the role of penicillin as an antibiotic. Chain and Flory. Antibiotics are chemical substances produced by some microbes and can kill or inhibit the growth of other microorganisms. This antimicrobial substance is widely active against bacteria and fight infections. 
The first antibiotic penicillin was discovered by Alexander Fleming in the year of 1928. However, its full potential as an effective antibiotic was established by Chain and Howard Florey. So the answer is option D. Question number 9. Which of the following evidence supports the hypothesis about the origin of mitochondria and chloroplasts as free living organisms? Endosymbiotic theory was given by Lynn Margulis in 1967. It is evolutionary theory of the origin of eukaryotic cell from prokaryotic cell. An endosymbiont is an organism that lives inside another one. The endosymbiotic hypothesis for origin of mitochondria and chloroplasts suggests that mitochondria are descendant from specialized bacteria and ingestion of DNA via endocytosis from another species of prokaryote or other cell type. So the answer for this question is option D. DNA. Question number 10. Match the following. See the first one. Synthetic is given. Uh, synthetic is matching with somatic embryogenesis. B is gene cloning. It is matching with Third one, polymerase chain reaction, haploid plants, it's matching with first one, anther culture seeds, fourth one, transgenic plants, it is matching with fourth option, recombinant DNA technology. So the correctly matching option is option A, somatic embryogenesis is involved and is the best choice in the production of artificial seeds. Gene cloning is a process of gene amplification which can be done by performing a polymerase chain reaction. Anther culture is an in vitro plant tissue culture technique used to develop haploid plantlets either through organogenesis or embryogenesis. Recombinant DNA technology is used in the production of transgenic plants. So the correctly matching option is option A. Question number 11. From the following diseases which is not due to contamination of water. There are various diseases which are spread due to contamination of food and water. The diseases like cholera, typhoid and jaundice spread due to bad quality of food and water. This contamination can further lead to serious complications. On the other hand, Hepatitis B is an infectious disease which is spread by exposure to diseased body fluids. In Hepatitis B, liver is infected. Hepatitis B is easily preventable by use of a vaccine. So the answer is option A. It is B is not transmitted through contaminated water. Question number 12. From the following which are concerned with asexual reproduction. Budding is a method of asexual reproduction whereas other follow sexual reproduction. Buds are unicellular structure develop an outgrowth on one side the daughter nuclei produced through karyokinesis shift into the bud. So the answer for this question is option A. Buds. Question number 13. Choose the incorrect statement. Surgical sterilization procedure such as vasectomy and tubectomy are recommended to small families where the couple wants to delay pregnancy for one or few years. This is because although the procedure is highly effective, the reversibility is very poor. Gonorrhea, it is a type of sexually transmitted disease caused by gonococcus bacterium called Neisseria gonorrhea. Syphilis, it is a type of sexually transmitted disease caused by a bacterium called Trypanoma palladium. Conchroid, it is a sexually transmitted disease 
caused by infection with bacteria Haemophilus genital wars. It is a type of sexually transmitted disease caused by a human papilloma virus. Genital herpes. It is a type of sexually transmitted disease caused by herpes simplex virus. So the answer for this question is option D. Surgical sterilization procedures for uh, contraception are offered to small families where the couple wants to space pregnancy for one or few years. So that is the incorrect statement. Question number 14. Identify the odd one out. The advantages of cross-pollination. Xenogamy transfer of pollen grain from anther to stigma of another flower on different plant of same species. This brings change in the genotype as genetically different pollen is utilized. This is allows the recombination of traits. Cross pollination introduces a new set of characteristics from a different parent which help in genetic variation and recombination. So the answer for this question is option D. Cross pollination maintains pure lines. So that is the odd one. Question number 15. How many among the following components are biotic, soil, pathogen, water, temperature, or light, slope, decomposers? A biotic components or non-living factors or physical environmental factors such as climatic, adapic or topographic elements prevailing in an ecosystem constitute the abiotic components. Biotic components are living organisms such as plants, animals, pathogens, decomposers and microorganisms. From the given, pathogen and decomposers are biotic. So, the answer for this question is option D. 2. Question number 16. The keystone species deserve protection because they. Keystone species are those which have a specifically high impact on particular ecosystem relative to its population. They play a very critical role in maintaining the structure and function of an ecosystem and influence which other types of plants and animals make up that ecosystem. So the answer is option D. Some species deserve protection because they play an important role in supporting other species. Question number 17. Secretions of following also helps in the lubrication of pennies. Bulbo urethral glands, also called as corpus gland, are either of two P shaped glands within the male located beneath the prostate at the start of the interior portion of penis. They secrete an alkaline mucosa like fluid which helps in neutralizing activity, that means neutralizing the acidity of the vagina and provides lubrication for the penis during sexual intercourse. So the answer is option A. Question number 18. From the four statements regarding secondary growth in dicot root. Plant growth are two types, primary growth and secondary growth. In primary growth, length of the plant part increases due to primary meristem. This activity achieved by the process differentiation. By differentiation, primary permanent tissue are formed primary meristem. In older dicot plants, primary permanent tissue becomes meristematic and produce secondary meristem by the process de-differentiation. Secondary permanent tissue are followed by secondary meristem through the process re-differentiation. So the answer for this question is option D. The given four statements C and D are not right. Uh, annual rings are clearly distinct is given. Pelogen cuts pellum on the inner side and pelodum towards outside is given. 
C and statement C and D are wrongly given because of the vascular gambium is completely secondary in origin in dicot root because of no intrafascicular gambium present. Vascular gambium develops from the tissue located just below the phloem bundle and a portion of pericycle tissue. In roots, the annual rings are not absorbed or not cleared because inside the soil. The temperature usually remains same through the year. Pelogen cuts pellum on the outside and pelodum towards inside. Hence, C and D statements are incorrect. Question number 19. Which of the following is not a prokaryote? Prokaryotic cells are single-celled microorganisms. These organisms are known to be old earlier than anyone on earth. Prokaryote organisms include bacteria and archaebacteria. The photosynthetic prokaryotes perform photosynthesis that includes cyanobacteria. Except Saccharomyces, remaining all are prokaryotes. The answer for this question is option D. Saccharomyces Yeast Question number 20 Which among the following does not occur in response to the release of angiotensin 2? The decreased reabsorption of sodium from renal tubule does not occur in response to release of angiotensin 2. So the answer is option D. As the blood pressure decreases, Juxta glomerular apparatus cells release renin enzyme to activate renin anginotensinogen aldosterone system. Renin converts anginotensinogen into the active form angiotensin 1 which is further converted into angiotensin 2 by the enzyme angiotensin converting enzyme. The angiotensin, angiotensin 2 hormone aids in the reabsorption of sodium in the sodium hydrogen exchange that takes place in the proximal convoluted tubule. So the answer is option D. Question number 21. The age related disease of a skeletal system osteoporosis may occur due to the age related disease of skeletal system osteoporosis may occur due to decreased level of estrogen. Osteoporosis is bone disorder that causes bones to become weak and brittle, sometimes a fall or even mild stress such as bending over can cause a fracture. Osteoporosis most commonly causes fractures in hip, wrist or spine. So the answer is option C. Question number 22. The roots are modified to perform a physiological function in Teniopillum lobatum Yellow ribbon root is leafless uh, epipytic or lithopytic orchid that is uh, leafless with a very short stem and flat green and photosynthetic roots. Rhizopora is an example of respiratory root or uh, aeropos found in mangroves. The horizontal roots develop upright aerial roots for breathing. On these, they bear small pores called lenticels near their tips for gaseous exchange. Reflexia shows extreme parasitism as the plant does not have stem, leaves or roots. These plants act as endoparasites and lives inside the vines of another plant with the body consisting of uh, filaments that spread through the vine to obtain food from the host. So the answer for this question is option D. The roots are modified to perform as physiological function in Teniopillum, Rhizopora, Reflexia, all of the above. Question number 23. Patella is an example of which of the following? Desmoid bones, these bones are uh, formed as a result of the ossification of uh, tendons at the joints. An example of such a bone is the patella. 
विच इज दि लारजस्ट सेसमाइड बोन अंड पीसी फॉर्म दट मीन रिस्ट बोन आफ मैन सो द आंसर इज ऑप्शन डी सेसमाइड बोन क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी फोर लिस्ट ऑफ क्रेनियल नर्स आर गिवन बिलो चूज द नर्स दट आर पार्ट ऑफ दि पारा सिंपथटिक डिविशन ऑफ ए एन एस दि पारा सिंपथटिक नर्व सिस्टम इज डिविशन ऑफ अटोनमिक नर्व सिस्टम इट इज नेम्ड सो बिकॉज इट्स न्यूरोन्स आर सिचुएटेड ऑन एद सैड ऑफ दि थोरा कोलम्बा रीजियन ऑफ दि स्पाइनल कार्ड दट मीन पारा मीन बिसेड the pns includes mainly the cranial and the spinal nerves it includes 1 3 5 6 there is option d try to remember oculomotor facial glossopharyngeal and vagus nerves are the part of parasympathetic division of ans क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी फाइव पॉलीट्राइकम एस विच ऑफ दि फॉलोइंग पॉलीट्राइकम इज कॉमन मॉस बिलोंगिंग टू क्लास ब्रियोपिडा दिस प्लांट इज ब्रियोपाइटा सो प्रोसेस दि फॉलोइंग सैलियन फ्यूचर्स द मेन प्लांट बॉडी इज गैमिटोपाइट दर इज नो कंडक्टिंग टिश्यू द गैमिट्स आर फॉर्मड इन दि एंथ्रीडिया एंड आर्किगोनिया The sporophyte is partially parasitic on the gametophyte. Spores are formed due to meiosis of the spore mother cell, heart-shaped prothallus. So the answer for this question is option B. Polytrichum has foot, seta, and capsule. Question number twenty-six. From the following, which plant hormone is primarily responsible for seed dormancy? Abscisic acid. Abscisic acid is also known as stress hormone. This is a growth inhibitor that the plant synthesizes in normal conditions. Question number twenty-seven. The sex pili in bacteria differ from pimbria in. Bacteria are ubiquitous prokaryotes. They occur anywhere and everywhere in water, in air, in soil, in all living organisms except the pits of volcanoes, deep strata of rocks, tops of high mountains, and blood of healthy animals. Being longer and in less numbers, sex pili in bacteria differ from pimbria, being larger and in less number. So the answer is option D. Question number twenty-eight. The rate of photosynthesis is dash than that of respiration during the daytime. The rate of photosynthesis is higher than that of respiration during the daytime. The answer is option A. Higher in plants containing chlorophyll, both photosynthesis and respiration occurs. in bright light photosynthesis is the dominant process that means plants produce more food than they use during respiration at night or negligible light photosynthesis almost completely ceases and respiration is the dominant process question number 29 from the following statements identify the one that is correct from the given statements both a and b are correctly given desert lizards absence of physiological ability that mammals have to deal with the high temperatures of their habitat gangaru rat fat is capable of meeting all of its water requirements by concentrating its urine so that only a minimal volume of water is used to remove excretory products desert lizard manage their body temperature by behavioral means so the answer for this question is option c both a and b are correct question number 30 the element present in middle lamella is calcium 
it is uh, absorbed by plants in the form of calcium carbonate etc it occurs in exchangeable form question number 31 from the following which is the correct chemical formula of oxyhemoglobin the erythrocytes contain a red colored respiratory pigment called hemoglobin it is an oligomeric globin which consists of four polypeptide chains joined to each other through non covalent bonds it contains a prosthetic group called as heme group oxyhemoglobin that is oxygen molecule combined with hemoglobin to form oxyhemoglobin approximately 97% of oxygen carried by hemoglobin only 3% of oxygen transported in plasma in dissolved state the answer for this question is option a that is a correct chemical formula of oxyhemoglobin question number 32 which of the following is are right with respect to metabolic reactions all the metabolic pathways in living organisms refer to a sequence of enzyme catalyzed reactions which convert the substance into final product so the answer for this question is option d given all the statements respect to the metabolic reactions question number 33 the metaphase 2 of meiosis is just like metaphase of mitosis except that the purpose of dividing the cells two times during meiosis is to produce haploid cells metaphase 2 of meiosis and metaphase of mitosis are similar to each other except in the number of chromosomes so the answer for this question is option a there are of as many chromosomes question number 34 in constipation the metabolic waste are retained within the colon because the bowel movement occur irregularly constipation is a disorder in which there is a retention of metabolic waste in the colon question number 35 aristotle lantern is found in the member of phylum echinodermata are spiny bodied sea creatures which possesses an endoskeleton composed of calcareous ossicles embedded in the skin echinoderms are exclusively marine bottom dwelling and free living animals so the answer for this question is option c c urchin arist question number 36 in no impulse condition the repolarization occurs with the repolarization of no is the no is the process in which negative resting membrane potential of neuron is regained so the answer is option a no impulse conduction the repolarization occurs due to efflux of potassium ions question number 37 hormone mainly secreted by corpus luteum the hormone mainly secreted by corpus luteum is progesterone progesterone is a steroid hormone secreted by yellow endocrine gland corpus luteum formed from empty graafian follicle during the pregnancy question number 38 the right relationship between the value of respiratory quotient is respiratory quotient is the ratio of volume of carbon dioxide released to the volume of oxygen taken in respiration the answer for this question is option d the relationship between the value of respiratory quotient is correctly given the option d question number 39 from the following statement each with one or two blanks is the first statement each pectoral girdle consists of 
clavicle and scapula each pectoral girdle consists of clavicle scapula then c is tetany is a condition of rapid spasm so the answer for this question is option b a is filling with clavicle b is filling with scapula c is filling with tetany question number 40 in the f2 generation of mendelian dihybrid grass the number of phenotypes and genotypes are in the f class the number of phenotypes 4 and genotypes 9 so the answer for this question is option d question number 41 hominid fossils discovered in java in 1891 revealed a stage in human evolution which was known as homo erectus Eugene Du Bois in 1891 discovered a fossil in central Java island of Indonesia from Pleistocene rocks Eugene Du Bois named it Pithecanthropus erectus Pithecanthropus means ape man Mayer in 1950 assigned it as Homo erectus. So the answer is option C. Question number 42. An international initiative taken in 1997 to mitigate climatic changes and to reduce greenhouse emission in called Kyoto Protocol. So the correctly matching option is option B. International initiative taken in 1997 to mitigate climatic changes and to reduce greenhouse emission is called Kyoto Protocol. Question number 43. Sarcoma is related to the cancer of which of the following? Sarcoma is related to the cancer of connective and muscular tissue, lymphoid tissue, bones. So, the answer for this question is option D. All of these. Question number 44. The monocotyledonous non-endospermic seed is seen in. The monocotyledonous non-endospermic seeds seen in orchid. The endosperm is the nutritive tissue in the seed and it provides nourishment to the developing embryo. In some seeds, the entire endosperm is utilized by developing embryo. Question number 45. Which is the maternal growth hormone of pregnancy? Human placental lactogen is the maternal growth hormone of pregnancy. Interdigitation of the chorionic villi and uterine tissue with each other leads to the formation of the structural and functional unit called the placenta between developing embryo and maternal body. Other than providing nutrition to the embryo, the placenta also acts as an endocrine tissue and produces several hormones like human chorionic gonadotropin, human placental lactogen, estrogens, progesterone, etc. Question number 46. Two kingdom classification was proposed by Two kingdom system of classification proposed by Linnaeus Linnaeus gave the first proper classification of organism into two kingdoms such as Plantae and Animalia. Copeland proposed four kingdom system of classification. Aristotle classified plants and animals based on few observable morphological or superficial characters. Whitaker proposed five kingdom system of classification. Quest number 47. The floral birds store food and help in vegetative propagation in which of the following? Answer for this question is agave. A bud is condensed immature shoot that has a growing point surrounded by closely placed immature leaves. Birds can be terminal or lateral. 
The axillary bud is a type of lateral bud that develops in the axil of leaves arising at each node. The agave plant has thick green leaves that arise sharp edged. A central flower stalk of 6 to 12 meters emerges from the plant and produces hundreds of buds approximately 5 to 10 centimeter long known as floral buds. Number 49 Uthika in female cockroach is secreted by which of the following? A pair of large ovaries is situated on the lateral side of the body. Collateral gland is branched paired gland. It secretes a type of Scleroprotein which forms the Uthika. So the answer is option C. Collateral gland. Question number 50. Ferns are characterized by Pteridophyta, a diverse group of plant, have evolved more than Bryophyta in the following aspects. Development of free living sporophytic generation. Development of vascular tissues. Acquiring total terrestrial habitat. In some species like Selaginella, development of two types of spores. Reducing the gametophytic phase into a smaller independent prothallus. Rhizomatous stem. Young leaves with succinate taxis and presence of ramanta. So the answer for this question is option C. Ferns are characterized by succinate taxis and the presence of ramanta. Question number 51. Human Genome Project was uh, completed in which year? A Human Genome Project was completed in the year of uh, 2003. The Human Genome was started in 1990 jointly by the US Department of Energy and National Institute of Health. Question number 52. The perception of stimulus of vernalization or cold treatment is received by Vernalization is the induction of flowering process in plants by exposure to the cold of winter for long time or by an artificial treatment. After this process, plants obtain the ability to flower but they require additional seasonal cycles or weeks of growth before they will actually flower. So the answer is option B. Perception of stimulus of vernalization or cold treatment is received by shoot apex. Question number 53. From the following statements, state true and false. So there are four statements are given. This is the statement A. In male grasshopper, 50% of the sperm has no autosomes. That statement is false. Sperm of a grasshopper has no sex chromosome. In 50% of its sperm has the condition in male is X0 type. So statement A is false. Statement B. Usually female birds produce two types of gametes based on sex chromosomes. So that statement is correct. C. Failure of segregation of chromatids during cell division results in the gain or loss of chromosome. Statement C also true. D. Henking could trace a specific nuclear structure all through the who genesis of few insects. So that is false. The foundation of a chromosomal basis of sex determination was laid down by Henking in the year of 1891. He traced a specific nuclear all through spermatogenesis in few insects. Henking also observed that only 50% of sperm received this structure. So the D is wrongly given. The answer for this question is option B. A is false, B is true, C is true, D is false. Question number 54. This is a column 1 with column 2. Here there are in column 1. Ladybird beetles feeding on insects. That is uh, matching with 
prediction ladybird beetles feeding on insect that is called as prediction so in the column 1b barnacles growing on back of a whale it is uh, matching with from the column to fourth one is an example for commensalism in the column one c wasp pollinating the fig inflorescence it is uh, matching with one mutualism d lice living on the skin of humans it is uh, matching with d uh, fifth one parasitism so the correctly matching option is option a in prediction only the predator benefits and the interaction is detrimental to prey commensalism interaction in which the commensals benefits and the host is neither harmed nor benefited mutualism confers benefits on both parasitism only the parasite benefits and the interaction is detrimental to the host so the correctly matching option is a question number 55 the extinction of the wasp population will also lead to the extinction of fig species this statement indicates which of the following causes of biodiversity loss co-extinction is the phenomena in which if one species is lost the other dependent species are also facing extinction so the answer is option b co-extinction Question number 56. From following statements, which of the statements are correctly given? See the statement 1. Agrobacterium tumefacens causes root knot disease and infect roots of tobacco plant. That is wrongly given. Melidogen incognita, a soil nematode, infects the roots of tobacco plants and causes the root knot disease. So, first statement is wrong. The second statement. Enzymes present in the saliva of insects convert the inactive form of Bt toxin into active form. So, that statement also wrongly given. The toxin produced by baseless rungencies is in inactive form called the protoxin. After the protoxin is in, in, that is uh, ingested by the insect the inactive toxin gets converted to the active form of toxin due to the alkaline pH of the alimentary canal so second statement also wrongly given see the third statement Bt corn has been made resistant to corn borer by introducing the cry 1 AC gene so that statement also wrongly given plant in which foreign gene have been introduced through genetic engineering technologies that are called as genetically modified crops so third one also wrongly given see the fourth one foods derived from transgenic crops are called genetically modified foods that is correct statement see the fifth statement the NIF gene for nitrogen fixation in cereal crops such as wheat, jowar, etc. is introduced by cloning rhizobium uh, meliloti. So, that also correct. So, from the given five statements, statement 4 and 5 alone correctly given. So, the correct option is C. First number 58. With respect to biogas, Choose the incorrect statement. Its production involves the aerobic digestion of organic waste. That is a wrong statement about the biogas. Biogas is a gaseous mixture of methane, hydrogen disulfide and carbon dioxide produced by the microbial action with the breakdown of organic matter in the absence of oxygen. So, 
the incorrect statement about biogas is option b question number question number 59 statement a ps2 is located in the oppressed region of grana thylakoid the statement b ps2 absorbs light of 680 nanometer in visible spectrum choose the right option both the statements are correctly given so the answer for this question is option c question number 60 poly embryony in citrus occur due to the embryos arising from the maternal sporophytic tissue are called as adventive embryos in poly embryonate species the adventive embryo arises by the proliferation of the new cell cells so the answer is option a poly embryony in citrus occurs due to new cells question number 61 the lignin is a component in the secondary cell wall of the lignin is a component in the secondary cell wall of sclerenchyma sclerenchymata cells have characteristic deposition of lignin in its secondary cell wall question number 62 which intermediate compound of krebs cycle is involved in the synthesis of an amino acid alpha ketoglutaric acid in krebs cycle act as you know catabolic process for the breakdown of glucose uh, proteins and fats it also act as an anabolic process of various intermediate products in krebs cycle The acetyl CoA is a precursor for biosynthesis of carotenoids, terpenes, gibberellins, etc. Succinyl CoA is the precursor for biosynthesis of chlorophyll and cytochrome. Oxaloacetic acid precursor for biosynthesis of alkaloids and pyrimidines. And alpha keto glutaric acid is a precursor for amino acid in Krebs cycle. the catabolic and an anabolic process it is called as amphibolic process so the answer for this question is option c alpha keto glutaric acid question number 63 which cells do not act as the target cells of hiv infections in the human body the answer is b cell hiv specifically affect the helper t cells uh, reducing the number of helper t cells due to this the human system fails to signal b cells to produce uh, antibodies and uh, cytotoxic t cells to kill infected cells thus the human system can no longer respond and becomes immune deficiency to many opportunistic infections so the answer is option b Question number sixty-four: Groundnut, bean, and alfalfa are members of the family Leguminaceae. The legume or the pea family, it is always called as Fabaceae family, is the third largest family of the following plants. About six seventy genera and nearly twenty thousand species of trees, shrubs, vines, and herbs. Question number sixty-five. Bursa of fabricus is an important organ of birds. This organ is associated with the bursa of fabricus is an important organ of birds. This organ is associated with the generation of B cells. The bursa of fabricus is a primary lymphoid organ of birds, which is involved in the proliferation and differentiation of B lymphoid progenitors. Question number sixty-six: The process by which water-soluble inorganic nutrients go down into the soil origin and get precipitated as unavailable salt is called as leaching. Fragmentation is the process breaking of detritus into small pieces by detritus. Leaching releases the nutrients in the water and allows seeping into the soil. which is used by catabolic bacteria to break down the complex molecules into simpler molecules through the process catabolism question number 
which of the following is the result of viral infection in plants tobacco mosaic and uh, turnip mosaic both are the following uh, result of viral infection in plants tobacco mosaic virus caused tobacco mosaic uh, disease in tobacco plants and the second one is uh, turnip mosaic virus causes turnip mosaic chlorotic lesions mosaic and uh, mottling are the common symptoms of the disease question number 68 a mother with blood group b type as a child with blood group type o what is the possibility of the genotypes of the mother and father the correct answer is the correct answer is i power a i power o that is a father and i power b i power o mother the blood group inheritance in human is a perfect example of codominance and multiple alleles which is governed by three alleles namely ia ib and i the ia and ib alleles are codominant with respect to each other and dominant over the recessive allele i so the answer is option c question number 69 which of the following leads to the development of disease cretinism hypo function of uh, thyroid gland the hypo function of thyroid gland leads to the development of the disease cretinism question number 70 dna was discovered by nucleic acids are the organic molecules that carry genetic information in all living organisms frederick mecher a swiss biochemist was first to isolate nucleic acid from the nucleus of first cells in 1869 and called it nuclein altman coined the term nucleic acid in the year of 1889 due to the acidic nature of nuclein So the answer for this question is option A. DNA was discovered by Mecher. Question number seventy one. The immature male germ cells undergo division to produce sperms by the process of spermatogenesis. Choose the correct one with reference to above. In spermatocytogenesis. the spermatogonia present on the inside wall of the seminiferous tubules multiply by mitotic division and increase in number each spermatogonium is diploid containing 46 chromosomes basically there are three types of spermatogonia is found in the humans dark spermatogonium that is a type a and pale spermatogonium third type is spermatogonium undergoes changes that is b type the secondary spermatocytes undergoes a second meiotic division to produce four equal haploid spermatids the number of chromosomes in each spermatid is 23 so the answer is option c secondary spermatocytes have 23 chromosomes and undergo second meiotic division question number 72 heterocatalysis question number 72 heterocatalysis occurs in heterocatalysis occur in g1 and g2 pairs the genetic material that is a double stranded dna in eukaryotes can perform two types of catalytic reactions first one is autocatalytic reaction one of the reaction product itself is the catalyst for the reaction in heterocatalytic reaction the template dna act and mediate the synthesis of mrna so the answer is option b question number 73 which of the following is endangered bird in india the answer is the great indian bustard some of the general characteristics of class aves 
they are uh, genuinely flying vertebrate having feathered bipeds modified hind limbs are uh, present which are generally have scales the respiration is through spongy and inelastic lungs Salim Mausuddin Abdul Ali was the Indian ornithologist and naturalist who worked for the conservation of endangered birds like the the great indian bustard by using his influence to gather the support of government for the organization and created bharatpur bird sanctuary at his service question number 74 which of the following is an incorrect statement with respect to use of anabolic steroids and other drugs to enhance their performance see the statement a narcotic analgesic anabolic steroids diuretics and certain hormones increase muscle strength promote aggressiveness and increase athletic performance so that is the correct statement see the statement b the side effect of anabolic steroids in females includes muscular relaxation mood swings depression enlargement of clitoris and deeping of voice that also correctly given see the statement c the side effects of anabolic steroids in males include again increased aggressiveness mood swings reduction in size of testicles and decreased sperm production so that also correctly given see the statement d in adolescent male and female delayed closure of growth centers result in x aggregated growth and gigantism so that statement is incorrectly given a statement with respect to the use of anabolic steroids and other drugs to enhance their performance that is the statement d is incorrectly given question number 75 flowers are zygomorphic in flowers are zygomorphic in gulmar the flowers has two types of the symmetry one is actinomorphic which is also called as radial symmetry and another one is bilateral symmetry it is always called as zygomorphic the answer is option b question number 76 select the option that correctly matches the structure with location and function the correctly matching option is option c see the structure hypothalamus it is located in forebrain function is controls body temperature urge for eating and drinking so that is correctly given so the answer for this question is option c question number 77 the duration between the first and second heart sound is the duration between first and second heart sound is 0.3 second the duration is 0.3 second duration each cardiac cycle two prominent sounds are produced such as lub and tub sound the lub sound is first heart sound which is produced by the closing of av valves during the ventricular systole the second heart sound is dub sound produced by the closing of semi lunar valves at the beginning of ventricular diastole 28 which one of the following hormone has extracellular or membrane bound receptor the follicle stimulating hormone one of the hormone as extracellular or membrane bound receptor cortisol testosterone and progesterone being steroidal hormones are fat soluble and can pass through the plasma membrane easily they do not require to bind with any extracellular receptors question number 79 the true statement about ribosome is 16s ribosomal rna is absent in 80s ribosome eukaryotic cells have 80s ribosome it consists of two subunit 60s and 40s the largest subunit consists of 28s 
5 years 8 years ribosomal rna while the smaller contains 18 years ribosomal rna so the answer for this question is option c that is a true statement about ribosome question number 80 and layer is present in between the ectoderm and endoderm in diploplastic animal is mesoglia uh, diploplastic animals have only two embryonic germ layers such as ectoderm and endoderm in nidarians such as jellyfish coral and sea anemones are examples the ectoderm layer generates tissue generally becoming the outside of animals where the endoderm layer generates tissue that lines the inside of the digestive cavity in contrast to many other animals so the answer for this question is option a question number 81 what are the monomer units in starch the monomer unit in starch is alpha d glucose starch is the most important polysaccharides in plants Starch is a storage polysaccharide with a repeating unit of D glucose, hence called homopolysaccharide. Question number 82. The natural selection that acts against change in the form of and keeps the population constant through the time is stabilizing. Stabilizing selection occurs when the natural selection favors the intermediate states of continuous variation over time the intermediate conditions become more common and each extreme variation will become less common or lost a population genetic variance shifts towards a new phenotype when exposed to environmental changes in directional selection so the answer is option d stabilizing 84 According to Bentham and Hooker system, the family Solanaceae be placed under the order Polymoniales. Solanaceae is placed under the order Polymoniales according to the Bentham and Hooker classification based on the floral or sexual characters. Question number 85. The arise from the pre-existing nuclei was first of all suggested by Strasberger. The nuclei arise from the pre-existing nuclei was first suggested by Strasberger. The major contribution of uh, Eudod Strasberger related to the characterization of mitosis and cytokinesis. Question number 86. PTOL of Australian Acacia helps in photosynthesis. The petiole is the cylindrical stalk that joins the leaf base with the lamina. In certain plants like Australian Acacia, the leaves are small and are short-lived. In these plants, petioles modify to form a flat green-colored leaf-like structure which carry out the process photosynthesis. Cost number 87. Infraciliary system is located in ectoplasm of ciliates. The infraciliary system is responsible for the coordinated movement of cilia. So the answer is option A, ectoplasm of ciliates. Question number 88. Genetically engineered insulin was prepared by an American company, Eli Lilly. Two scientists, Stanley Cohen and Herbert Boyer invented the technique of DNA cloning. Their discovery led to the development of a recombinant protein with therapeutic applications such as growth hormones and insulin gene encoding for human insulin were cloned and expressed in E. coli. Eli Lilly is an American company first prepared DNA sequence corresponding A and B chains of human insulin. So the answer is option B. Question number 89. An aldehyde of vitamin A is an aldehyde of vitamin A is retinol. Retinol is an intermediate formed in vitamin A visual cycle. 
option is uh, transmembrane protein which binds to retinal so the retinal is derivative of vitamin a question number 90 this is the last question which is incorrect for dna the charge of dna is negative so here the option d is wrongly given the charge of the dna is positive is given so that is a incorrect statement about dna thank you very much for listening our videos those who are watching our videos you are requested to like subscribe and share to your friends all the best